My name is John. I grew up in Indiana. I now live in California, and I am about as diet in the wool Republican as one can be in terms of my family history. My granddad was an, a mayor, a Republican mayor, and my father was a Republican state senator. And in my early days, I was a Republican. I worked on a Republican Senate campaign in Indiana back in the 70s. But when it came to Trump, um, you know, that was it for me. Uh, I, what I want to talk about is Republican loyalty. Uh, I understand that. I understand people who, who can't bring themselves to vote for a Democrat, no matter who the Democrat is, or can't bring themselves not to vote for the Republican, no matter who the Republican is. And I just had to come to face to face with the conclusion that my loyalty first and foremost is to my country and not to my party. And I don't think that, Repub that Trump represents Republican values uh, as I have under always understood them to be. He's not really a Republican. He's really just a, a, an authoritarian who has managed to you know, appeal to certain people's uh, prejudices. But um, he's, he's just a, a terrible, terrible president, a terrible, terrible man. And you see in this pandemic how his incompetence has manifested and his total in inability to execute real leadership in a crisis. So please, uh, I ask you to consider, before you pull that lever on Tuesday, November the 3rd, where your real loyalty lies. Is it to the Republican Party? Or is it to the United States of America, to the Constitution, and to your kids and grandkids and the world that they will live in? Thanks for listening.